Hey guys, welcome to the 2 a.m. pipe on a patio. Today I'm smoking my Falcon Shillelagh, the blue one, with some Mylon Tobacco's Joe's Blend. An exquisite uh, English blend. I just love this. So it's beautiful skies, beautiful weather. It's getting cold here, it's starting to get chilly. We got the tail end of the of Ian came through over the weekend. We had some high winds and rain and for three days. And, well, it rained for three days. We just had the high winds the one day, which was Friday night, Saturday morning. Nothing bad, nothing too bad at all. And uh, it was nothing bad at all. And uh, nothing compared to Florida and the Carolinas got. Uh, we, uh, We just got some 35 mile, 35 mile and 40 mile an hour winds here, and that was that was about it. Some rain, got about an inch of rain or so, so it wasn't too bad. We had some flood warnings, but didn't seem to materialize. We didn't get the rain they thought we were going to get here. A little other areas got some some worse stuff than we got. But beautiful beautiful here today it's just gorgeous down in the 50s beautiful blue skies as you can see man it's just not a cloud in the sky so Friday uh, Denny found me a screaming deal on a air compressor on Facebook Marketplace. She just finds the best dang deals. So, Hossfield Campbell, 200 psi, 15 gallon air compressor. Thing looks brand spanking new. Uh -uh. Was right here in town, so we didn't have to go anywhere far to get it. And uh, that thing will give me all the power I need, I think, to get those nuts and bolts off that mower. And uh, so that's my plan for tomorrow. Just to get all that pulled apart, put the new spindles on, put that all back together, and then hopefully get the the deck put back onto the mower and, and be back up and running in the next couple days and uh, hopefully tomorrow I'll have it all back up and running uh, barring no unforeseen circumstances It's a, it's a beast that, that compressor is a beast. That'll run every, every tool I have, that's for sure. The little pancake I had was only it was two and a half gallons and I think it had a 60 psi or something like that so it just wasn't enough 
to run my tools. It'll run like the Brad Nailer. I think it's more for um, like painting using a, a airbrush type thing. But uh, it definitely won't work for a uh, impact wrench. That's for darn sure. You know. grinders or impact hammer any of that kind of stuff but anyhow I just wanted to do a quick little video here because I haven't done one in a while and I did one Thursday and f absolutely f forgot to put it up and it was all kind of time specific topics so I just decided not to put it up at all because it was too late by the time I realized I hadn't put it up it's, it's drag getting old man I'll tell you But anyway, so that's all I have to talk about today. So I'm going to cut this one short, keep this one short. I will catch you all later. Have a good one. God bless. And I'll catch you later on. Take care.